Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. EQA Nostalgia here. Today I want to talk to you guys about the Fine Bros debacle. The, the shit that's going on right now. You see, you are seeing in real time, and not obviously this video isn't live, but real time from as I'm speaking, okay? You're looking at it as I'm looking at it. The subscription drop-off of Fine Brothers Entertainment. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I wasn't going to talk about this because everybody's been so on point with this. And it's one of those things where people are, they just kind of nail it, and then you're just kind of left there saying, yeah, everybody's already kind of talked about it. But I have to talk about this, guys. I have to talk about this, because this might be the most monumental fuck-up in YouTube history. These guys are in damage control right now. And let me bring you up to speed in case you don't know what's going on. If you're if you're kind of living under a rock, maybe you've been busy, these guys, they... Uh, they want to trademark React videos, and uh, they wanted to create this React world shit, okay? And uh, I never I never liked React videos, I gotta be honest. I did a couple of reaction videos to things like uh, Final Fantasy VII Reveal, but uh, they're most known for Teens React and Elders React to the dumbest shit, like trying to play NES, and, and these kids are like, how do you put the cartridge in? And, and it's just really, in my opinion, I'm not trying to sound like a dick, guys, but I think it's really lazy, and I think it's very uncreative, and I don't know how it ever took off. Actually, I do know how it took off. Two years ago on Christmas Eve, I got a story for you. Uh, I went over to my sister's house and my niece, she was like seven years old. She was watching uh, Nickelodeon and it was Teens React. They, I guess they even made a television show off of this shit, okay? And she absolutely loved it. I was sitting there just rolling my eyes like, oh, how is this entertaining to people? I don't, I don't get it. But uh, I never liked it. I always thought that it was cheesy and it was really lazy, like, it's the easiest thing in the world to just have other people react to shit for you, upload it, and profit. So, first of all, I, I just want to say 14 million subs. They had over 14 million subs for doing this shit, you know? And I don't want to sound like a hater, but I don't, you know, there's some people that just don't deserve what they've got. And I, know, and I really don't think that they deserve what they got. Now, what they got now, they definitely deserve it. Because they're trying to tell people that if you make React videos, that shit belongs to us. They have flagged people's videos. They've had people's videos taken down because they've had uh, React in the hashtags. <laughs> they took down uh, 8, -bit, 8 bit Eric. In case you don't know who he is, check him out. He's got some good content. They took down some of his videos. So they've bullied people, you know, they were, they, uh, they reached out to Ellen, I think on Twitter it was and said, Hey, you know, how come you guys had a react segment on your show and you didn't, uh, you didn't give us a shout out or anything, something to that effect. These guys seem to think that they own the word react, that they own that shit. So they came out with this grimy ass sales pitch saying, Hey, uh, you know, we want you guys to make content with us and be part of our community. And uh, we want to include you. Well, really, it's so fucking nice of you. How nice of you, Fine Bros. How fucking nice of you to include us in React videos. Guys, I'm going to do a review. I'm going to do a review right now. And uh, I'm, I'm going to fucking make that review mine. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell everybody else that they can make reviews too. If you join my network, guys, you can fucking make reviews. You can make rant videos. And I will cut you in on that shit. I will. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Get the fuck out of here. You can't trademark that shit. You you don't own that shit. People fucking reacting to anything. I mean, this is this is public domain kind of stuff here. You know, you can't copyright claim that shit, dude. You just can't do that. And I know these these uh these copyright laws, they're just they're archaic as fuck. They need to be updated because we're living in a completely different era. I think these copyright laws were written in the fucking 70s, dude. It's time to update this shit. Get with the times. and You won't be seeing this kind of shit happening. And this is just one of the things about YouTube, man, where it's just... Look at that fucking drop-off as I speak. Good. Good. I'm fucking glad you're losing subs, you arrogant assholes with your unoriginal bullshit. And yeah, you could say I'm being a hater, but come on, dude. Come the fuck on. Some people deserve what they get. And these guys never deserve to be famous in the first place. They've got a they've got a company built around this. I can't even imagine 14 million subscribers. Holy shit. So they took off like a shot. I mean, they built a company around it. They're like, they're like a corporation. <laughs> people are just are rising up against them now. And they're in damage control mode. They, they told everybody. They made a video 
where they came out and they were like, no, 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 no. Uh, you guys don't understand us. And they added further insult to injury by telling people that we didn't understand because they, they didn't really, uh, they didn't speak truthfully enough. It wasn't, uh, they didn't get their point across right. And we misunderstood them. Nobody fucking misunderstood you, pal. You're greedy. You want to fucking market something that does not belong to you. You can't do that shit. So I'm watching this drop off like damn. And and you know, I never put two and two together with these guys, you know, Fine Brothers Entertainment. I never I've seen React videos before and thought it was the dumbest shit I've ever seen. I didn't know who did it. I didn't know one person was really uh kind of monopolizing this and now they want to further monopolize it and pull all of it in so that it's all theirs. Everything React is gonna be wants to be theirs. That that shit is not gonna happen. That shit is not going to happen, and they've lost, I don't even know how many subs. They were at 14 million something, <laughs> they were like less than 24 hours ago. And the only reason why I heard about this was because of Alpha Omega Sin. That, I mean, I absolutely love this guy's channel. He's one of the people that really inspired me to get going. I mean, as a content creator, I don't watch a lot of content, guys, but Alpha Omega Sin, I watch a lot of his stuff. And the Game Chasers, you know, Angry Video Game Nerd, some things I watch for that inspiration and uh, because I genuinely enjoy their content. But as a content creator, you know, I'm more busy creating than watching. But he, he turned me on to this. And <laughs> it's all over the place. I mean, this is a huge fuck-up, a monumental fuck-up. But I want to hear from you guys down in the comments section. Let me know what you think about this. Please let me know if there's ever been a bigger fuck-up in YouTube history. Because I'm pretty sure people are going to be talking about this one for years. If you guys like this video, please remember to rate it. Thumbs up. If you're new here, I ask that you please subscribe. I thank you all for watching. And uh, I look forward to seeing you all in my next video. Look at that shit. Look at the drop-off, man. Damn. God damn.